So we all know what the American flag is. It's a pretty iconic flag, and you know it whether you live in America or not. But not a lot of people know where this flag came from, so today, I'll explain where we got this flag from. Now, you would think that the current American flag that we have today was designed based off something that happened during a war, or maybe an idea that one of the presidents at the time had. Well, it was actually designed by a 17-year-old named Robert G. Heft. So what happened was that Robert's teacher assigned a project for the class that they had to make their own flag. And at the time, the American flag only had 48 stars. And this was during the 1950s, so there were still 50 states. And a lot of people were confused about this because each star was supposed to represent one state. So, Robert spent five hours sewing 50 stars on this flag. Now, you would think that he would get an A plus for this because, well, this literally became the next flag of America. And he put a lot of time and effort into this. Well, ironically, he got a B minus because it was unoriginal. And his teacher said that the only way he could get an A on this assignment was if he somehow made it the next United States flag. So you know what he did? He shipped it out to Congress. Then two years went by and Congress liked the flag so much that they officially made it the new flag of the United States of America. Now, whether he actually got that A plus or not is unknown, but let's be honest, he deserves the A plus, and if that didn't get him an A plus, nothing will ever get anyone an A plus in that dude's class. Honestly, I feel sorry for anyone who took this guy's class. But anyways, that's all I have for you for you guys today. See y'all next time, and as always, have yourselves a very good day.